tried to say and Evan Mobley jump it up and USC control so away we go good look inside Peterson immediately with the two-handed stuff and it'll be Edie White Mobley Mobley and Peterson worth noting Ethan Anderson is not going to play in this game for USC as Peterson feed inside Isaiah Mobley gives out to younger brother Evan jump stop turns flips it up and in it's just been one of those programs that always seems to be in the mix okay. Peterson puts it on the floor finger roll is good Mobley and it's USC basketball they're up by three Mobley puts it on the floor hangs and hits Wow fruits and ranking them Evan Mobley one of the best in the land and at least a quick glance one game and about three and a half minutes I wide open look just could knock it down USC by three UConn basketball book night gets another I think that just gives you a zero to your plus minus yeah probably yeah not really sure, but he yeah, got the waiver. Yeah. Yeah. On our second game, we're going to get a chance to see the season debut of yep. James Carnick. Really threw back the shot from Agbunk Polo. Whaley jumper. That's a three. Oh, tip. The offensive action's kind of slowed down, and Peterson hasn't been aggr as aggressive. When he's cutting and moving, I feel like the offense is better, whether he's getting shots or not. That helps. Yeah. Ball in Jalen Gaffney's hands. He and Cole, the two guys that will lead him at the point, and Gaffney knocks down a three. They've looked good. Yep. Andre Jackson into the game as he gives off here to Tyler Polly to the corner and Adams little floater short and that one put home by Josh Carl was a really good shooter played D3 basketball at Johns Hopkins with over 2,000 points Agbunk Polo able to get it to go good body control and then the soft touch the handle shot clock is winding down Bowman gets the jumper to go. They're saying it's a two, the transfer from San Jose State. We get downhill, get to the basket. Bowman jumper, got it to go, and that's four. Jumper will fall there from. The key in the high post area is not just having a big guy who can catch and throw to the other side. It's having a playmaker. If you don't have a playmaker in the middle of the zone, you're not going to be able to get him. each other. No. Bobby was here with Arizona State, not able to, to see Danny. Like, I think considering the circuit. UConn just hasn't been able to get inside on the bounce, and that's where defense really shifts the most. Carlton gets inside, and one, as if on cue. Edie goes to work, shot contested, blocked. He wanted a foul call, and here's Book Knight on the move. Cole launches a three and hits. It doesn't feel like anybody's really, I mean, yes, UConn's up, but it doesn't feel like anybody's really done anything to establish themselves. It's just back and forth. Mobley kick out. Goodwin gets inside, spinning, flips it up and in. Chavez Goodwin the bucket. Book night, kick out. And Whaley not able to hit. Cole will try and hit. And trying to track it down, loose ball, and eventually Peterson finds it. Goodwin, they get a three on one, gets it back and puts it in. Book night here, floater, that'll go. He's just Team Mobley inside to Goodwin, shot blocked, and UConn will go the other way. Good work by Whaley to come up with a block. Martin inside, left hand is good. Huckabee. Yeah. And Florida went to the Final Four, and then they met Chris Heron's freshman year that fall. Yep. Uh, 
up and under. Oh boy, and that goal is for Tyrese Martin. Presser, they've attacked on offense. The defense has had more pressure. Mark inside. That wouldn't go, but the follow there from Whaley. Edy, three-pointer, got it, and they needed it. The ball in his hand, and when he's aggressive looking to shoot, he's a much better offensive player. And again, no Ethan Anderson out with a back issue for this game. Mobley gets inside, and that little jump hook is good. Jump shot on what would be a pretty easy look for most people. Mobley gets inside and gets it to fall. Nice shot by Isaiah Mobley. So 56-49, UConn with the lead. The Roman Legends Classic still to come. Boston College and Florida. Bauman knocks down the shot. USC aggressive defensively. UConn gets it back. Shot clock winding down. This is Whaley spinning, throws it up and in. Isaiah Whaley with the deuce. Freeze gave him time to get it up. Mobley inside, and book it. Two more for Isaiah Mobley. Pools a met. Jay Heath back. The foot injury that caused him to miss a single game. Book night and plus one, he'll go to the line. I mean, he's the school. Mobley inside. In close, couldn't hit. Mobley the rebound and puts it in. That was aggressive. Point of the season, not a lot of uh, you know practices, limited exhibition, no exhibition. Isaiah Mobley gets one out of two. Pearson gets inside. No call. Kicked out. Bauman, that's a three. Rebound. Mobley a three. Can't do it. They had multiple cracks at it. And UConn hangs on to win it, 61-58.